Hello everyone, I had to redo this one. Um, the previous one had a little bit of a problem with the with the uh, circles. They weren't showing very good, so I wanted to do that regen, if you remember in class, R-E-G-E-N, to make sure that uh, it's clear. So I cleared it up a little bit. So let's try that again. And let's go through this command again. It's divide. Type divide. Select the object, which happens to be the P line. You can see that it's selected inside there. It is selected for sure. Um, I don't want to do number of segments yet. Down at the bottom it says I want to need a block, so it's going to be a B. The name of that block is called links. There it is. It sees it. Align block with object. Yes, I do. It is already default, so I just hit enter. Enter the number of segments. In this case, it's going to be 44. And bam, there it is. It shows you all of the uh, links drawn in. And you can see how it follows the circle pretty close. But uh, again, as I explained earlier, it is based on the center point of the link. So that means that the two circles will be offline going around the radius. But it follows it evenly all the way around. And then again, it lines up. And then it goes around and it comes a little off all the way around. And back to there. And it's all done. And that's what you're looking for. So remember divide command and make sure that the links file is actually in the folder that you're going to be doing all your work in. Um, I should have it as a download when the exam comes up. All right. Thank you.